Hi guys, it's Zach with Herco North America. And today I'm gonna to show you how to keep your rotary axis from having to unwind itself on your Herco mill. As many of you know, if you're running a rotary program and you tell it to rotate 3,600 degrees in the positive direction, you're typically gonna to have to wait for it to unwind itself or move 3,600 degrees in the negative direction at the end of your program. And we know that you don't have time for that because time is money. So today, we're gonna to show you three ways to program your rotary to unwind to zero in less than one turn. If you have a conversational program already made in your control, go to the review screen by pressing the review key on your control panel. You want to highlight the location of the program where you want the block to be inserted. So select the insert block before soft key. After that, click on the rotary and transform plane soft key and select Rotary Position. You're gonna see at the top of your screen a field called Reset Rotary Encoders. Go ahead and select Yes. Now, when we go back into the program, we can see that we've inserted a Rotary Position data block. So when we run this program, the rotary will automatically reset itself to zero for us. So that's it for method number one. So let's move on to the other two ways that you can reset your rotary. With these next two methods, we can insert an M31 command in both conversational and NC part programs. Let's start out first in the conversational side of the control. After the program has commanded the axis to wind up, we'll need to add a data block so that we can add an M code to the program. We can do this by first pressing the review key. Place the cursor in the location where you want M31 inserted. Then select the insert block before soft key. Press miscellaneous. Press machine function. And from here, you will type in 31 into your M code field and hit enter. Another option is to select M31 from the provided list. Once you find it, go ahead and select M code. You're gonna now see M31 is commanded in the conversational program. Once we've done this, we need to tell the control our rotary position. So we will need to go to the review screen again, and we're gonna highlight the location where you want to insert the rotary command. Then select insert block before, and then press the rotary and transform plane soft key. In the rotary position block, we wanna make sure that we have the A axis turned on. When we run this program, the rotary will automatically reset itself somewhere between zero and 360 degrees. And that depends on the command rotary position that we input. So that took care of the conversational side of the program. Now we need to work on the NC side for our rotary unwind. To do this, we need to go to the NC editor. Press the part programming soft key. I want you to then type in M31 wherever you need to reset the rotary. And if you don't have G0A0 already in your program, go ahead and type that in now below your M31 command. And again, you'll notice when we run this program, the rotary will automatically reset itself somewhere between zero and 360 degrees. There you go, guys. Three ways to reset or prevent the unwind for your rotary on your Herco mill. Please remember to like this video, hit that subscribe button, and click that notification bell. See you guys next time.